I want to talk about one of my favorite things is uh, a, a item, a product, an invention called Bakelite. Uh, a lot of you Yik. know of what Bakelite is. Don't and to me, ever since I was a kid, it screamed of quality. If you've ever held Bakelite in your in your hands, it's, it's unlike anything else that uh, they make today. It was like a heavy duty plastic. And I hate to use the word plastic because there's a lot of cheap plastic compounds that don't do the word justice. But uh, Bakelite has been around since uh, 1907. Leo Bakeland invented it from Yonkers, New York, and uh, and it was made under pressure and, you, like I said, using formaldehyde and other chemicals, and it's uh, it has really great properties as far as thermal properties and insulating properties, and you'll recognize it. It's on a, a lot of stuff, yeah. Oh, what have I done? <laughs> I've messed that up. Hold on, I've messed that up. Reggie, you're such a little klutz. You idiot, what did I do? Anyway, oh we are. Well, you know, you know the, um, my favourite person I like to stalk is, um, Scout Crafter. And, uh, here I am. Okay, nah. Yeah. And it was made He's under pressure and, and you, like I said, And I was thinking, about... well, what have I got Bakelite? Well, I'll show you that. But what I find more interesting, or as interesting... Is that we uh, he introduces us to this now? Watch now. Let's just put it there and let's have a look. Right. Big light. Okay, and last up, and look. my fabulous big mega light items. Mega. I was at Elephant's Trunk a little while ago, and I found this. And uh, the guy says, "You know what that is?" And I said, "You bet I do." do yeah, I bet I it do. It is a insulation tester because we're going to be doing electric motors. Yeah. And uh, we could thank Terry for that, Terry Benko, for sending over that beautiful Century motor he sent over, and that's what started us on this quest. Now, what this is, this remember we're talking about testing the windings, how you test the windings. This is an insulation tester. And basically what it is, it's a generator that sends through 500 volts DC. Okay, so, 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 what's that got to do with Reggie's shed? Well, <laughs> look at this. Look at this. This is made of Bakelite. It's an amp tester. And can you see, look, it's a mega. It's a mega, look. Made in England. Hmm. Um. There we are. Can you see? So get out the glare. That's it. Get rid of that shine. There we are. A mega circuit tester made of bakelite. Hmm. So what? Are, and in its its case, it's you know the electrician man. They knew how to. That was um. At its time, that was. I'm guessing it must be GPO or something like that. I just like the, the box, you know, the, the case that it's in. I've got quite a few of them, but that's the only Bakelite one. And talking about um, Bakelite, again, I bought this for the box. I, I want the box for some reason and not so much the inside isn't. But this, is this Bakelite as well? I think this is Bakelite, but in a flat form. Like a sheet of it. But that's Bakelite. But the reason I like this was I like the box. Yeah. Anyway, anyway, talking about what's in the box and that sort of a thing. Let's get rid of this. Let me give you a hint. And I'm sh I'm guessing this is the same machine as what um, Scout Crafter has got. But obviously, I guess, because it's in a wooden box, it's uh, older. But look, it's... Uh, Hold on. I'm trying to sit it on here. I'm trying to sit it on there and it won't sit there. Because, oh, yeah, I'll put it there. Right, okay, we're there. Um, I'm guessing because this is older, or in a wooden box, I'm, guess, I'm guessing this is, uh, this is the same thing. Look, this is a, this is a mega, look, yeah. And do that. Take this clip off. Take, come on, take that clip off there, open that. And this, look, this is a mega. This is the same, look, a mega. 
Mmm. And it has its instructions in there, look. Uh, what it does. Yeah. It's got the same type of um, gauge, haven't we? Yeah, same. Oops, let's look at it that way. That's upside down. That's looking at it that way. You see? But what I like about this is you can actually see the inside of it. Let's clip that back in. Now, I know the handle works good on this. Never pick this old stuff with the handles because you'll break the handle. But look, what I love about this is you can actually see the workings. You can see the goings on. You can, you know, you can see the damn thing. Hold on. I'm going to end up... I've not really set this up proper yet, have I? Look at this. That's what I love about it. You know, the... the qu I don't know what age this might be, whether there'd be a date on it or whatever. But look at that. Talk about... Look. So I'm guessing this is the same sort of thing. This is the same, but because it's in the wooden box, I'm guessing it's um, it's older. Let's have a look. And it's got. Did you have a date on it? Hmm. Yeah, forty-two. Look, it's got this certificate thing. Look, in it, and it says nineteen. 42 it was tested in 1942. Mm. So, <laughs> it's very funny how we seem to be attracted by the same stuff. So, tell me, if you'd seen this, would have you picked it up? If you'd seen this, would have you said, oh yeah, I'll have that, mate? How much is it? <laughs> You've got your spending money with you. The same as this now. Would have you have um, picked that up? Uh, I know I'm a bit odd. I've got quite a few of these. Um, and I'm sure if you go and find, if you go and uh, go down through my films, you'll find the, the collection of uh, my electrical tester. But I've got two megas. Ooh, 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 ooh. It's funny how we're attracted to the same stuff. <laughs>